find HTF or G3 are the following by division method. HTF and G3 are same. HTF means highest common factor. G3 means greatest common divisor. First set of number 6, 40. Divide the bigger number by smaller number. 40 is the bigger number. So divide 40 with 6. So write 40 here and 6 here. We know 6 into 6 is 36. So write 6 here. 36 here. Put the minus sign. 40 minus 36 is 4. So write 4 here. Reminder is not 0. So continue the division process. Last divisor is 6. So write 6 here. Now we have to divide 6 with 4. 4 into 1 is 4. And 4 into 2 is 8. 8 is greater than 6. So consider 4 into 1, 4. So write 1 here. 4 here. Put the minus sign. 6 minus 4 is 2. So write 2 here. Reminder is not 0. So continue the division process. Last divisor is 4. So write 4 here. Now we have to divide 4 with 2. 2 into 2 is 4. So write 2 here. 4 here. Put the minus sign. 4 minus 4 is 0. So write 0 here. Reminder is 0. So stop the division process. Last divisor is 2. So 2 is the HCF of 6 and 40. Next set of numbers 28, 63. Divide the bigger number by smaller number. So write 63 here and 28 here. Now we have to divide 63 with 28. 28 into 2 is 56. So write 2 here, 56 here. Put the minus sign. 63 minus 56 is 7. So write 7 here. Reminder is not 0. So continue the division process. Last divisor is 28. So write 28 here. Now we have to divide 28 with 7. 7 into 4 is 28. So write 4 here. 28 here. Put the minus sign. 28 minus 28 is 0. So write 0 here. Reminder is 0. So stop the division process. Last divisor is 7. So HCF or G3 of 28 and 63 is 7. Next set of numbers 200, 300, 500. Here three numbers are given. First find the HCF of two numbers 200 and 300. Of these two numbers, 300 is bigger number. So, we have to divide 300 with 200. So, write 300 here, 200 here. 200 into 1 is 200. 200 into 2 is 400. 400 is greater than 300. So, consider 200 into 1, 200. So, write 1 here, 200 here. Put the minus sign. 300 minus 200 is 100. So write 100 here. Reminder is not 0. So continue the division process. Last divisor is 200. So write 200 here. 100 into 2 is 200. So write 2 here. 200 here. Put the minus sign. 200 minus 200 is 0. So write 0 here. Reminder is 0. Stop the division process here. Last divisor is 100. So 100 is the HCF of 200 and 300. Now we have to find the HCF of 100 and 500. Of these two numbers, 500 is the bigger number. So divide 500 with 100. So write 500 here. 100 here. 100 into 5 is 500. So write 5 here. 500 here. Put the minus sign. 
500 minus 500 is 0. So write 0 here. Reminder is 0. So stop the division process here. Last divisor is 100. So 100 is the HCF of 500 and 100. So HCF of 200, 300 and 500 is 100. 